Oh, here we are, back in Skyblock. And for once, I've almost got too many blocks to choose from. These guys are producing a lot of blocks. And, well, I don't really know which ones to build with. Hello everyone, and I hope you are doing well. Welcome back to Skyblock, and today we're going on a little adventure. We have some clues that we would like to work on, plus we still have a few blocks we'd like to gather along the way. But to make both of these a little easier, I thought we would come down and use this anvil to combine some of our tools. We have two bows here to make one power three bow, plus we have a pickaxe that we could combine to fortune two. Now, that is expensive, but we could get Fortune 3 here. Hmm, a little bit of trading, and that could work. Let's see how this iron farm's doing. Okay, okay. We got some iron, at least. Who would like some iron? It's still warm. Some more blocks, maybe. Okay, small bit of trading later, and we've got Fortune 3. Nice. And we'll just ignore the iron golems not making it into the pit. So now that we have this shiny new Fortune 3 pickaxe, well, we can't go mining with it, but we can go out in this direction behind me because I believe there are two more islands with some fun trees out there. And we want to keep going and gathering some more trees, some more blocks in case we do want to do some big buildings going forward. So got a bunch of stone slabs and we're going to go looking for acacia and dark oak. Now, the reason I'm using this pickaxe is, well, we don't want another spruce sapling incident. I still don't have spruce trap doors, and it still hurts a lot. But hopefully, this Fortune 3 pickaxe will allow us to get a couple of um, acacia saplings, as well as at least four dark oak. Okay, there is our dark oak, and there is our acacia. All right, let's do this. Oh, our little base looks so weird down there. I still haven't quite got over how weird Skyblock looks. Okay, let's make a little platform out and protect as many of these leaves as possible. And probably also light this place up if we can. All right, fortune three, let's see. Well, we got one at least. There's two. Okay, five is not too bad. So let's go make sure they're safe at home and then we can try our luck with the dark oak. All right, dark oak. I'm coming for you. Okay, one. Still not enough for a tree, though. There's two. That's three. Let's collect that. These are so precious. And there's the fourth. Okay. Well, let's do the rest, I guess. Okay, nine saplings and a bunch of wood is not bad whatsoever. So, let's get it safe, and then let's move on. Ooh, so the dark oak seems to be enjoying itself. Still waiting on you, Acacia. Hurry up. But while our wood source is growing more and more, I think it's worth going for our next clue. And here it is, clue number three of ten. I feel like we've done more, but we haven't. The sun, it be hot. In this place ye can rest. A grand desert structure be concealing chests. But heed this ear warning, there be traps underneath. If ye be careless, ye visit be brief. Well, as we said last time, I think that's the desert island we found. So let's put this clue with the rest of them. Let's, oh, you know what, why not? Let's use our snazzy diamond armor. We can just trade it back if we lose it, right? And we won't lose it, will we? We have our power three bow with some arrows. Oh, we can take one of our delightful axes. And I don't want to take the fortune pick, but we do have an iron pick here. That should be good enough. Or we can take some torches as well and grab a bit more food. Let's grab a bed and some blocks and let's get ready for some more adventure. No, oh, wait, I'm not ready. Do I not have a shield? I feel like we've got one right here. Shield ready. Now let's go. Now, this place is impressive. It's a very cool thing. It reminds me of um, Aladdin. I assume that's what they were going for here, but I do not trust myself enough. So I think we're gonna build a little base camp here. All right, spawn set. 
let's go see what we can find. Now, I think the smart thing to do first, because we are smart, is actually probably wait for the sun to go down, sleep, and come back in the morning. Yeah, tactical. Let's do this tactically. All right, fresh new day. Same tactics, I reckon. We light up here out, just in case we have to come out and it's nighttime. Whoa. Oh, that was so loud. Oh, okay, I need a break. Sheesh, that was loud. Gosh. Okay, well, some eggs. Let's light up here as well. We want no surprises. I'm not good with surprises. And let's head down. You regular or trapped? Even if it's a trap chest. Let's open it. Golden apple, some sand and string. I'll take the golden apple. Down we go. What do we have here? That's definitely a trap chest. Wish me luck. Aha. Uh -huh. Another trap chest. Nothing. There was a door here before. Not just me, right? Okay. Maybe take the things out? No. Put them back? No. Uh, let's light this up, but then do something with this. Like, is this a puzzle I'm supposed to solve, or do I just go through the wall? I'm not great with puzzles, so through the wall I go? Yeah, I feel bad, but I'm not good. Oh. Same thing again. Mm, some bad books. And the wall's there. Okay. Well. I feel bad for breaking your puzzle. Those are cool. Another trap chest. Ooh, the other side and a treasure hunt book. Yay, okay. Um, so silent. Um, well, let's read the puzzle. Clue four of ten. The land be full of color where tall flowers grow. There be a lone sunflower hidden below. Scavenge every inch for the secrets be ear. If ye find this one plant, ye clue be near. Okay, we know this one. Yeah, let's just break out of here like we broke out before and it will be fine. Well, assuming that was everything, that was fairly easy. And we already know where the next place is, so I guess we do a double clue? Yeah. Let's put our items here we don't want to lose, and let's head to the flower forest. And it was a sunflower, I think, was the clue. So let's have a look. Now we've already been on the island, so I don't think it's gonna have a jump scare like the uh, like the desert one had for us. That was, uh, whew. So I'm still not recovered from that. Okay, sunflower. Hello, you see a sunflower anywhere? Nothing this way. Chicken, but no sunflower. What's well, down the back here? Oh, there's a creeper. That's what's down the back here. There's another one. Fantastic. What is this? Oh. And chicken. How many creepers are in here? Um, let's go to bed and come back in daytime. I mean, the only place we haven't searched is in that hole where all those creepers were, so... I guess that's where we're going. There's a skeleton around here somewhere as well.
Ooh, double flowers. Okay, okay. Here we are. Oh! Found it. Well, that was completely by accident. All right, what have we got with this one? Clue five of ten. In unlet halls and wooden walls, ye find a secret room, but be not bold, for ye have been told this may be your tomb. Uh, it sounds like a mansion to me. That'll be fun. Well, let's get this stuff home. I'll leave the flowers here, but I'll come back for them. Ooh, snow. Well, those clues went smoother than expected. And to be honest, now I have a little bit of a dilemma on my hands. Originally, I had thought it would be nearly time for the dragon fight. But as I've been doing these clues more and more, I kind of feel like it'd be kind of cool to see if I could do this whole thing without doing the dragon fight. I'm not sure if the map allows it or whether there are certain things that you need, but it would be quite nice to do it. But I also think it would be a lot easier to head over with wings to the mansion. Exploring the map with wings is going to be a lot easier than without. And you know what? I'm not sure. I think I'm going to spend a bit of time gathering a few more resources and weighing it up. Whether we go straight for the mansion or whether we take on the dragon. How about you let me know your opinions in the comments below and we'll see which one happens. I can see benefits to both really, if I'm honest. Either way, I think our next adventure should be out and trying to find the witch help because I believe that's where the sugar cane is. And whether we do the mansion or the dragon, I think having a few librarians with some good trades will help us out a massive amount. But I think for now, I'm gonna spend a bit more time gathering some wood and figuring out what it is exactly I want to do next. And to start next week, we'll go find that witch's hut, and then we can decide if we want to go down the route to get the dragon, or if we want to go straight for that mansion. Thank you so much for joining. It has been a lot of fun today. I have been recovering from being sick, so that's why my voice and energy levels, oh, hello tree, might have been a little different, but thanks for bearing with, and until next time, bye bye uh, to be honest, neither the dragon nor the woodland mansion sound exactly chill to me. I guess, well, we gotta do them at some point. I just thought maybe we'd have a little more time before.